And then uh, I was sitting like that. It hit me on the head, cut uh, the skin, and then uh, stuck there. There is a hole over there. 40-year-old Andrei Motovets says what happened to him yesterday is a miracle. To be honest, it's happened so fast I don't even have time to think about it. <laughs> the car he drives into Seattle for work now has a giant hole punched through the glass. There are shards all over his dashboard. Somehow this chunk of metal didn't kill him when it flew into his car. I was listening to Christian radio, yeah, thinking about some spiritual things. And then boom, yeah, the metal rod just fly through the windshield. The state patrol says it happened Monday afternoon along the southbound lanes of I-5 near Federal Way. Mordovet says he was driving home from work and out of nowhere this chunk of steel flew directly at his face. The bar left a nasty gash in his head but somehow his injuries weren't more severe. They scanned my brain and everything okay so I just have the yeah just have the scar here so eight stitches on my on my head. By the God mercy I'm still alive and I can talk to you. The state patrol says it doesn't know if this bar fell off some vehicle in front of the driver or if it was picked up and kicked into the air by another. Finding out who it belongs to could be impossible. Now this father of five believes his spirituality is proof that a higher power watched over him and kept him safe, knowing what could have been had the flying bar caused even more serious damage. Value the life more, yeah. I have to think about spiritual things more, you know. I have to... Yeah, I have to live a decent life, you know, and use every moment of it.